Looking good, looking good. Gonna love this. Dinner is served. Voila. More beautiful than ever. Thinking of that time that Reggie served me your head on a platter. <laughs> <laughs> you two really like, did some weird shit. Um, you helped. Yeah. It seemed so important at the time. He said you left practical jokes. You started them, right? You don't understand, Louise. Reggie's so different from the kind of man I meet at work. He makes me feel so alive. The men I meet at the museum, they're all so stuffed. <laughs> <laughs> I know, but you don't have to go to the other extreme and date guys like Reg. I mean, you're not getting any younger. I think about little else. So? What are you gonna do about it? You really need to clean up your act. Oh, God, Louise, you're beginning to sound like Harold. <sighs> yeah, well, you should listen to your friends. We love you. And we don't like seeing you miserable all the time. I am not miserable. Oh, Louise, what's wrong with me? <sighs> Next on my list is Reginald himself. I think he wanted to kill himself, do you? No. Reggie loved life too much. Loved life? I never thought he loved life. I always thought he was kind of afraid of it. You know, like escaping, like Peter Pan. Oh, Louise. Just because a guy likes to have a good time, it doesn't mean he's escaping. I got a job, a real job, and I brought home the bacon. I don't believe you. In here, ma'am. I'm just like Harold now. Good job, comradeship, advancement opportunity, paid vacations. Smart uniform. Knew you'd like it. Dare I ask what it is that you do? It's a, a position of grave responsibility. Does it have something to do with burgers? <clears throat> Buns as well, ma'am. I like you in uniform. Really? Yeah. That's a bit small, don't you think? Well, I'm growing to it. Will you? Mm. And the pants? They, uh, <clears throat> they'll stretch, ma'am. Will they? Mm. Let's see. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Open your mouth. <laughs> We need motives and we need clues. Come on, time is running out. Oh, God. I mean, was he involved in the mafia? No. Gangland violence? Of course not. Well, what did he do in Brooklyn? Why didn't he take you there to visit him, hmm? These were all very, very important questions. He just wanted his own space. Oh, right. Yeah, right. You know, you're just saying that because you didn't really trust him, did you? I mean, you hated him for not taking you to his secret hideaway. I didn't hate him. Let's go examine the crime scene. Come on. Ah! 
What's this? Reggie's anniversary joke. A tape recorder and a candy box. Pretty intricate stuff, if you ask me. Maybe he was a terrorist or something, and we didn't even know it. I mean, how much did you actually know about this so-called Reggie, hmm? How much does anybody really know about anybody? I mean, you never made any effort to find out anything about his background, did you? What's wrong with that? I don't know. But I know that if you know somebody, you're supposed to really know them before you know them, if you know what I mean. Really not taking this way I expected at all. Where's your sense of humor? I don't find this at all funny. Well, it got pinned to the kitchen table with a samurai sword, singing candy box. It's great. Louise seems to be enjoying herself. Laugh. You're sick. I'm dead. You've always had a sick sense of humor. You love my sense of humor. Never. Never. I thought you loved my sense of humor. That's why I did everything, to make you laugh. Dad's feeling much better now. I wish they didn't bring him. Oh, somebody's going to make this picnic a picnic. <sighs> All right, let's take this. Oh, that's good. Maybe some blankets. Voila. Oh. All right, ready. Yes. Little old Mrs. Brenner died. Did I tell you, Vivian? Mm. Oh, I'm sorry. Wasn't she over 90? Yes, yes, but it was so sad. I mean, nobody even came to the funeral. There's nobody ever wants to talk about death. My whole society is afraid of it. In some cultures, people live with death all the time. They accept it. It's natural. It's part of life. They don't hide it in some undertakers. What's healthier, if you ask me? 